Hey everybody, Anel here with NKY Honeybees. Welcome back. Today we got an exciting video. So today we're gonna take a look at some of these new packages we installed last week and make sure the queen is in there and she's laying um, so far. It's been about nine days or so. So um, she should be laying all of them actually. So we're gonna take a look and see. So last week, if you haven't seen the video, I'll put it up here, up here, or up here, not sure. But um, I installed the packages on Wednesday and then I released the queens on Friday and they have enough time to actually start laying. So I'm going to take a look, go through the hives, take a look at a couple of frames in each hive. Probably won't do a deep dive in the hives because it's, there's no need. Just want to make sure a queen is in there and there is eggs in there. So let's go in my hives and take a look, see what's, what we can find today. All right, guys, first hive up is my horizontal hive. Uh, my observation horizontal hive, I should say. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and give them a little bit of smoke, get them out of the way. So basically what I'm looking for today is make sure queen is laying and make sure they got some resources in here. You don't want them to starve. It's really crucial at this point. Like I said, I didn't feed these because I had um, pollen and bee bread and honey left over. So I'd rather just give them that instead of feeding. However, you know, you gotta make sure that that's enough. If it's not, you're gonna have to give them some supplements to make sure they survive. All right, so I can already see some of these frames, like first few frames are just empty. As, as you can see, I gave them, uh, I think full, full rack of frames, which is 13 frames. That's what I started them with just because it's spring and shouldn't be any robbing. They should be fine to keep keep up with this. Just gonna move this over. Bees are nice and calm. That's nice. So let's take a look. Frame of fresh nectar in here. I do see some pollen. Bees are super calm. That's beautiful. Let's take a look at the other side. Not much here. Just an empty frame. The queen should be probably a couple of frames in. Like I said, these should be quick inspections. I'm, I'm simply looking for eggs. Uh, this got some weight to it. Okay, here we go. Look at that. So there is already capped brood in here, which is beautiful. That's what I wanted to see. I'm pretty much, I've pretty much seen what I want to see, but I'll take a look at a couple of more frames. However, as you can see, there's a lot of pollen nectar on the sides. This, this is what you want to see or what I want to see. Uh, let me see if I can see the queen anywhere. This is all laid up too. Just fresh eggs. That's beautiful. Let's put that back. And go on to the next frame. Man, spring is just awesome. Yeah, lots of pollen on this one. There's also bees with pollen. We've had kind of crazy weather though. It was, it was just raining and tornadoes and all kinds of unnecessary things going on this spring. Yeah, this is all laid up. So this is all fresh eggs and larvae. I don't want to keep that out too long. But let's take a look at one more, la one last frame and then we'll move on to the next time. And there is the queen. Look at that lady. Yep, this frame is pretty much laid up as well. So there's a lot of bees coming really fast. That's a beautiful queen. Again, from Greg Burns, Nature's Image Farm. That's awesome. Always love seeing the queen. So we're going to put this back and then I'll move these two back. I'll put this back together and we'll go to the next hive, see how the other hives are doing. Hopefully they're all the same. So let's jump right in about here. Why not? It's a new package. 
they don't have that many bees, but they will soon. Yeah, this is just fresh nectar here. All right, trying to find a better angle here. So this is fresh nectar. That's all that's in this one. Actually, I'll put that to the side. Okay, let's move on to the next frame. So again, what I'm looking for is actually the queen. And there is some capped brood. This is beautiful. This is all capped as well. And the middle here has a lot of larvae. So the queen is here. They accepted the queen and that's beautiful to see. Let's take a look at the other side. Not much here. So we'll put this one back. Take a look at another frame. See if we can spot the queen. I know she's in here, but it's always nice to see. Look at this beautiful brand new comb. And this is definitely all laid up. This is all fresh eggs in here. There you go. Just bringing this in a little bit. You can see a lot of pollen and these, the rest of this is just laid up with fresh eggs. So the queen is in here. What that tells me, they accepted the queen. She's laying. Everybody's happy. The bees and myself. I don't see the queen. This is also young larvae in here. A couple of capped cells, but that's pretty much good to go this high. All we have to do is wait for this to actually make some bees and start preparing for the winter. I don't know if we're going to have any honey out of this, but this is fairly heavy. Oh, wow. This is all laid up back to back. A lot of pollen and nectar on this side and this side. So, so far this looks awesome. Perfect. And there's my queen right there. She's going and laying everything up. That is beautiful to see. That's all I wanted to see on this one. Definitely a good hive so far. Second one. So hopefully the other two are the same. So putting this back together, we'll jump over to my next hive and see what we can find in that one. Woohoo. Exciting, man. This is super exciting. All right, let me take a look at this one. We'll start right from the middle. This is really bee bread and fresh nectar. Put this aside so we can work with the rest of the hive. And just a couple of frames in, or even this one, could be eggs. Once I see eggs, oh, wow. That's a lot of fresh nectar, full frame. That's beautiful. That's beautiful to see, my friends. Just an empty frame here. A little bit of nectar. So I'll turn that around. Somebody asked me, why do I flip the frame sometimes? This lady is trying to sting me. Come on now. Don't be mean. Uh, so sometimes, if this side is full of nectar, I'll move it away from the, uh, from the brood and keep this empty side here so Queen can actually lay that up. That's usually the reason. Um, if it's brood, I won't move it around. All right, let's take a look at this. And here is the first surprise. Woohoo! Queen cell. <laughs> really? Come on now. Take a look at that. See what I'm talking about? You never know what you're going to find in here. Queen is laying. I can see eggs, larvae in here, in this frame. Um, or else I wouldn't touch that and I probably won't until I take a look at another frame and see the queen now. Uh, if I do find a queen, I'm going to take that out. I'm not sure why they're doing it. They're probably trying to supersede her, replace her. That's what it looks like. But I am not in the mood for that. It's way too early. And this is all eggs too so this is all laid up so the queen is in here and laying so let's take a look see if we can spot the queen see this is why i check the hives that's the problem if i didn't they might have replaced the queen i don't know what would have happened might not have one she might have not come back who knows um this one has quite a few drones actually so this is all laid up two eggs but I see a lot of drones in this hive. Let's take a look at the other side. 
So I'm looking for the queen. Oh my god, there is another queen cell. So they're definitely looking to replace this lady. For whatever reason, bees know more than we do sometimes. However, I don't like it. I don't want this to start replacing hives. It's just way too early for me. Uh, hives, not hives, queens. So I'm going to see if I can find this queen and take a look at her. I'm sure she's in here somewhere. So this is full of bee bread, pollen, beautiful colors in here. Come on now. And another queen cell, couple more. Come on now. That is not what I wanted to see. There is definitely a queen in here though. There is something somebody's laying. So these queen cells, yep, they have eggs in them. So I don't know why they want to replace her. Sometimes you just have no clue. I don't see her yet. I do see eggs. So she's in here or she was. They might have removed her. Who knows? I don't see her. Interesting. I might have missed her on the first couple of frames. So, I'm going to go back through this. I don't want to kill those queen cells until I find the queen and make sure she's in here. So, I'm going to fast forward till I find the queen. All right, guys, so I went through the hive like three times, did not find the queen. So something happened to the queen. She was in here at some point because there is a couple of frames of eggs and just a young, young larvae. So she probably laid up some and something happened to her. I don't know. They killed her. She froze. Who knows? Got too hungry. I'm not really sure, but something happened to her. So now I need to uh, take a look and find a new queen on this hive. Um, either let them requeen themselves, which I left those queen cells. I did not kill them. So it's a good thing. I looked for the queen first. I was convinced queen was in there, but she wasn't really. And if I didn't check in probably a couple of weeks, I would have had a lane worker and a lot of these bees would have been dead and this hive would be struggling throughout the whole summer. And then you got a big headache. So that's why it's always good to inspect these beehives. So Let's go to the next hive and I'll work on this hive, work on finding a queen or let them requeen themselves. Um, not much of a choice. It's still early in the season. All right. So let's jump to the last hive and hopefully we don't find anything like this. <laughs> okay. Let's take a look at this last hive. Another one of my horizontal hives. Hopefully we don't find what we did in the last fake hive. I'm hoping Queen is in here and doing her job. But as you can see, you never know what's going to happen. Come on, ladies, go down there. Also, the last hive had way too many drones. It's just not more than I would like for this time of the year. All right, let's give them a little bit of smoke, get them down there. All right, let's go through this one. Just an empty frame. Same here. So we'll have to go a couple of frames in. Let me see. All right, this got a little bit of weight to it. Oh yeah, another empty frame. Yeah, lots of fresh pollen on this one. I don't see any eggs yet. But... That doesn't mean anything, not just yet. It's too early. Let's take a look at this frame. Woohoo! -hoo. There's a lot of bees in this one. Yes, I see eggs on this one. So I do see some eggs right here. Um, it is laid up. Has to have to get a good angle. So let's. Let me go on this side. Yeah, that's all pollen. Entire frame of pollen. That's good. I definitely know they have pollen because they keep bringing pollen in. 
I see on the front entrances when I take a peek. There is some nectar too, not much, but there is some. Uh, I had a new frame in here, I guess. And they're building that out. I don't see the queen yet, however, I do see eggs. It's laid up, so... I'm not sure why I had a new frame in here. Must have put it in here by mistake, to be honest. But I'm gonna leave it now since they started it. Beautiful, always beautiful to see new comb. Alright, hopefully I see some better production here on the next frame. Woohoo! Yep, exactly what I wanted to see. Look at this, there's some capped brood. Mm -hmm. This is entirely laid up. So the queen is in here. This one is doing just fine. Even though I didn't see the queen, let's take a peek on the other side. Maybe she's here. Who knows? Yeah, this is all laid up. Just larvae. It's gonna be capped in probably a day or two. Absolutely beautiful. No queen cups, cells, anything like that. So I'm a happy beekeeper. So let's take a look at this last frame since I've got this open anyway. Why not? It's a beautiful day. I probably won't get to check them for another 10 days or so. Okay, come on out. Alright, this is just fresh nectar pollen and uh, what you would expect to have in the last frame. Yep, an empty one. Yeah, I didn't see the queen, but this queen is definitely in here. There is capped brood. There is a lot of uh, fresh eggs, a lot of larvae, no stages. So this one's really good to go. So let me just go ahead and put this one back together. And then we'll talk about something. That hive that we just found. Queenless. Alright guys, so I've checked this one. This one has a queen, um, has larvae and eggs in those stages, even cat brood. So this one's just fine. I didn't see the queen, but it's just fine. Uh, so the only uh, thing that I got a problem with is that fake me hive. It doesn't have a queen, doesn't look like it unless I missed her, but um, I can spot a queen fairly easy to be honest. And there's only some laid up eggs, so I don't know what's going on in that hive. I'm gonna have to look for a queen. It does have a lot of drones in that hive, which is not to my liking, it's way too early. There's a lot of drones in there. Um, after I went through the other frames, I've, I've taken a look and there's just abundance of drones. So I'm gonna take a look at um, around here, see who has a queen. And as always, I'll share everything with you. I'll share probably um, getting a new queen and keep you updated on that hive too, as I do for the other hives. So give me some comments if you've seen the queen and I didn't. Um, I'll take a look another time when I watch the video later on when I edit it but I don't think she's in there um, I'll have to go find one anyway thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed the video keep inspecting those hives so you don't run into problems or lose hives all right guys thank you I'll see you in the next video